We is back. And it's story time. Story time. Put the little edit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. God damn it. Back for another edition. Time to tell some stories, huh? Of the storytelling. In the hood. <laughs> In the ghetto. Huh? All right. Just trying to get some food. Nigga was hungry. All right. So I go, I go in, I go to the, uh, to this little, this little food shack. No, I fuck the food shack. We call it the deli. Nigga the was deli. At the, nigga was at the deli. You All understand right. me? Yeah. Went to go get some damn fries. Order some fries. Probably like $3 or some shit like that. Get some fries. And then I think I, I think, I think I came up the street or something right up the street. Or did I bounce? Mm. I bounced in the car. Hmm. What you mean? After, um, after you got the fries? Yeah, after I got the fries. Uh, I don't, I don't remember if you came in the car or you bounced in. I think we it all stayed. We all stayed inside, right? All right. So I had some fries. No, 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 no. I had some fries. I went to the car. You feel me? And we, he feel me. I was about to. Uh, I opened up the bag to eat them. And they all was burnt as hell. Going to go back into the deli. Go back into the deli. I tell the tell tell bro, and that's what it was. You went you went in there because you was about to go get some food, I think. Yeah. Or something like that. But we went back into the deli and I tell the motherfucker, hey, you got you burnt my fries. You feel me? And this motherfucker gonna say, he gonna, he gonna say, he said they, they don't look burnt to him. And I grab one fry. All right. And I take a bite out, I take a bite out of the fry. I'm like, man, this shit is burnt. I heard, yeah. and this motherfucker say, "You ate one." He said, "You ate one." You know, you you can't get your money back. <laughs> yeah, that's how you do you. And I'm like, "Nah, you got me fucked up." The motherfucker would not give my money back. I flipped out, and I ended up flipping over this man's uh, cash register and shit. Credit card reader. Credit card reader. You know what I'm saying? I was flashing out on him, and I went into the uh, we we went into the car. All right. Mm-hmm. Oh, you want me to go from there? Oh, yeah, 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 this is where oh. you get involved because you was in the car. He's about to pull off. All right, so the motherfucker, Trey, I hear Trey in there flashing with the nigga about the goddamn fries. All right. Um, he flashed. He flipped his shit over the goddamn counter. I thought the deed was done. It was over with. He was scared. This is a little Asian man. You know what I'm saying? Everybody knows a little Asian nigga to bit the goddamn deli. So. The car is parked right outside the goddamn door. Parked all illegal and shit. Nigga shit. You know what I'm saying? We parked right outside the door. So I come out the door and I'm about to get in the car. And Trey about to get in the car too. But here come the Asian nigga flying out. He got his phone and his motherfucking camera in his hand and shit. He trying to get the license plate. You know what I'm saying? He looking around. He trying to find the license plate, get the front of the car. That's what I'm like, man, are you fucking serious? Nigga? <laughs> I don't know. Nigga, so I'm, I, first of all, I'm a pog. This is my partner. Almost like you know, I I fuck with you every goddamn morning, you damn fake nigga cheese. You know what I'm saying? Sandwich nigga. You know, how what you trying to be like that for? You know, this is your problem with this nigga. So, of course, we start charging after that motherfucking nigga. We ran his ass to the goddamn restaurant. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He cowered into the motherfucking spot. We got up on him. And Trey pushed to the wall. Boom. And I get up on him. And we looking at him. And and we both I can see. Both of them and Trey here, like we should whoop his ass. I think we was like, yeah, his ass is whooped. Man, so Trey, uh, Trey cocked back, right? Trey cocked back, and I see how far the man didn't cock back. I see the look on my brother's face. I see the fist. I see the Asian man. I'm like, yo, Trey is finna gut this man to oblivion. If I let this happen, all right, we can't never come back here again. This man probably about to die. But with this man Trey, but Trey was big. Trey was bigger than he is now. <laughs> by that time, nigga, Trey came back like this, nigga, and held it there in slow motion. And all I could say was, "No!" <laughs> <laughs> for some reason, <laughs> for some reason, bro, I did not want you to hit that nigga. I couldn't. I didn't want him to get hit. Yeah. I didn't need to do all that shit anyway, man. You know. He was finna spear his ass, nigga. What the fuck, nigga? 
I just, I just, I just wanted a refund for my fries, man. That's yeah, all I, I wanted, know. man. You was gonna get a refund and retribution. <laughs> you was gonna get it all, nigga. So nah. So so after I after I stopped Trey from fucking taking this man's gut out of his goddamn stomach, I I, I flinch up on him and I push him back to the wall and I grab his phone. I throw it over the counter. <laughs> And I tell him, don't do that shit no more, man. Some, some, some. I didn't really be too hard. We got up out of there and shit. You know, we left. All of this violence for no reason. All this goddamn violence. Nigga. We only need to say, I can't say that wasn't for no reason, no, man. No, nah, I mean, no. Yeah, of course. But it, I didn't have to go that far. But yeah, he got what he, he, he it, it went to the extent where it should have went, if you ask me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It got, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and to this day. I was still, we were still able to go over there and cop our smoothies. He got a new card reader. He understood he couldn't burn niggas' fries no more either. And not you know what I'm saying? Refund. Without, without getting a refund, you know what I'm saying? And yeah, sometimes you got to show a little muscle. You know, that's all. Can't be in the hood, you know what I'm saying, being disrespectful and shit. Mm-mm, especially with them trying to get our money. Right. That shit nigga, niggas need to change too. But uh, yeah. Mm. Black owned businesses. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Is there a moral of the story? Moral of the story is don't fuck with niggas with dreads. Ah. All right. <laughs> Two kings out. <laughs> I have to go drink some oat milk, nigga. <laughs>